was making all the excuses of like, Mackenzie sleeping. It's Monday, you know, you've been through all these things. I was like, Mackenzie, if you don't shut up. In a private plane, I lamp on it. Let the old and call me bank on it. Look at these babies. Look at show them come num star, put the gun on him. Twist my fingers up on a bang on him. Let the old and the old. It's like, Kenzie, who are you going to Whole Foods? I feel like I'm fancy beach. <laughs> Parmigiano Reggiano. We're about to just get in our bag of becoming. Becoming the me that I have always envisioned myself to be. I heard the Lord say, play with me if you want to because you know I told you we're not doing that. <laughs> Why would you say I can't get candy and you took me to the candy store? As much as it is convenient, we're in a season where, baby, we don't have convenient type of money. Make your food at home. Chopping up the mess. Drop it in the water. Let the daughter find an image with the rest. She'll be learning how to breathe. Spinning through identity. Reveal another pretty little scheme. Save her mind. Hold her hand. And don't believe a lie, you understand me Walk her down the valley, pack a piece of heaven for the bottoms of her feet Teach her how to jump and how to stretch when she reach Like the angels do, and you gon' make it through now Tell about the healer, greater is the one within and call him as the leader Teach her how to hold a pretty hand up to the sky And I'ma wait up on the giver, he'll deliver like a dealer to take her higher, higher Fly out the valley and the fire Take her Running. Show her every door and how the windows let the sun in Copy out the key and tell her this is for becoming Even in the fever, baby, cry and get to running And tell her that you better get your bootstraps up You're with the army Ready when the truth act up, nothing can harm me Yelling from the roof, I touch, put up a guard and count to ten Lion's den, speaking with the higher pen Can't be touched by fire, then Fast forward to the grown things now I'm working on them soul things now Forgiving all your old ways But it's harder on the cold days Cold days Never been a product of a flaw or this environment Never acted like I'm higher than You, 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 you And I still pray Dear God, won't you send me a break Cause, Cause I, I need to get away, yeah It is a Monday and it is 3.53. I'm outside of the gym just waiting for it to open. Um, I'm just really proud that I woke up this morning, y'all. I know y'all be hearing me say that, but I have told y'all so many times, I am not a morning girly. So whenever I wake up, baby, best believe that is a huge accomplishment. And like today, I literally woke up and I was making all the excuses of Mackenzie sleeping. It's Monday, you know, you've been through all these things. I was like, Mackenzie, if you don't shut up, like, when they talk about you don't negotiate with terrorists, baby, I've been negotiating a lot with the terrorists because why are you talking to me? You act like you, this is new. You know what we be doing. You know what's up. You be tripping for real. Um. So, yeah, y'all saw me this morning. I stopped to get a gallon of water because we have to make sure we're going to just do better this week. We're going to do better all around when it comes to the eating. We're going to do better when it comes to the gym. We're going to do better when it comes to just simply taking care of Mackenzie. 
Um, I want to do a lot better about prioritizing me and my needs and acting like I got some sense. So y'all remember when I was doing the water fast, I told you guys that the Lord was telling me to make sure you keep these same practices when you're not on the fast and everything will be okay. Did I do that? Mm -hmm. No, I have not. And if y'all don't know, if you haven't watched the fast, when I say keep those same practices, I'm talking about before you run to food, did you go read your word? Did you go talk to God first? I really want to start being intentional about before I pick up some food and before I go to eat, can I journal and read the word first? You know what I mean? Because then it helps me make better decisions. But anyway, I'm about to gather my thoughts. I will see y'all after the gym. Bye. Hi, rookies. Okay, it is 614 and I'm back at home and I'm about to make my little green drink before I get in the shower because I know I'm going to have to pee it all out. So we're going to start early. So that's exactly what we're about to do. I do, uh, I need some more fiber because I'm pretty sure, yeah, I'm about out, but it's okay. It's enough, it's enough for what we're needing to do. I did okay. I said I need to do better about making sure I'm getting home on time because I'll be in that sauna and I'm like, I can sit in that sauna forever. And that's exactly what I be doing. And I'm like, no, and especially like days like today, I need to eat breakfast. And I mean, I guess I can eat it at work. I just need to make sure I can make my sausage. Today, I'm gonna make me some poly sausage and some oatmeal and I don't have milk. So I was just gonna make my oatmeal with some um, vanilla protein. And yeah, let me make sure y'all can see me. Yeah, I was going to make some strawberry oatmeal and some vanilla protein, but I wanted to make sure I had some meat because I know my period is coming and my cravings is about to run rampant. Um, so yeah, we're about to make this drink and then we're about to hop in the shower. Thankfully, I have these twisted, so I really don't have to do much. I'm just going to lay the edges and put a scarf on and put a claw clip on. So yeah, it sucks. I need to order me another one off of Amazon, my little spin thingies. These. I'm so sad. I had a good run with this, but I replaced the batteries and everything, and for some reason it's not working. So I've been drinking this little chunky drink just trying to get it down, but baby, it's not. It's, mm -mm. So we got the ACV, we got the collagen. Carry on. Y'all, my workout was really good. I was talking to Chelsea and I was telling her how it's crazy because I know my period is coming. Oh. Why is this such a deep container? Hold on, y'all. I gotta focus, cause this ain't doing what it's supposed to be doing. Give me a little more in here. I was telling Chelsea how I know my period is coming um, this week. And usually when my period is coming, like I start to cramp and stuff, I start to cramp before or after my workout. It's never in the middle, like, like during my workout. I feel like that's so disrespectful. I was on the elliptical and I had the goal of doing the elliptical for 40 minutes. Y'all, I was like, baby, I gotta do 30 minutes and I gotta go because I started cramping on the elliptical and I was like, how freaking rude is that? Um, so yeah, I was just talking myself through. I knew it was gonna be a tough one when I started the elliptical and literally my first minute, I was like, oh Jesus, absolutely not. Um, but I'm proud I talked myself into finishing my 30 minutes so it is what it is. And then I sat in the sauna. Um, the sermon that we watched today was Hazardous Conditions by Sarah Jakes. And that was so good. Yeah, oh, there was a chunk in there. See, what do y'all want from me? But anyway, y'all, I'm about to finish drinking this. And then I will talk to you guys later. Y'all want to cheers? Cheers. Hey, y'all. It is 12 o'clock, it is lunchtime, and I am doing something very impulsive. I am doing something very impulsive. Um, hold on, I gotta focus on backing out and praying that nobody comes and hits my car. Um, so y'all know, I'm pretty sure you've seen people talking about the Crazy Puffs at Little Caesars. Well, we're about to go try them, and I am so thankful that they sell them in very small servings and just four. Because if they sold them in like a box of six or eight, I wouldn't have been able to control myself. But four seems like a good little serving. So I was about to go get those on lunch with some of their hot wings. And then we're going to be good. I actually intended to go to Whole Foods on lunch. 
because I was watching my favorite YouTuber, Mia Snow, and she was talking about the Caesar salad that she was making and going to Whole Foods. First of all, the lettuce that she got from Whole Foods is what made me be like, I want to go to Whole Foods because I've always loved me some salads, but I've never been able to find me quality lettuce. But then it's also because I know that I stay at Walmart. I, I've given up on thinking I will ever find quality lettuce at Walmart. So anyway, the lettuce that she had was just like beautiful. So I was like, I want to go to Whole Foods. And then two, she was raving about this cheese, par Parmigiano Reggie. I don't know. Of course, I've been saying it all day. And now that when it's time to tell y'all, I can't remember. Parmigiano Reggiano. It was something like that that she was talking about. She too got from Whole Foods. And she was saying how much real cheese, natural fresh cheese has saved her life. And also talked about how less in calories it is. So like that, I want the cheese, the Parmigiano Reggiano, that's what it was. I want the cheese and I want the lettuce so I can make me salads for the week. Um, Yeah, and then it's so cool. Have y'all heard about Just Meats? And so Buki, just wait, I'm trying to get us hooked up. I'm trying to get us a deal. It is so freaking cool seeing that I'm at a place where I can basically sell myself to businesses to see if, hey, do y'all want to give me some free samples so I can share it with my people or not? And Just Meats is basically a brand where they have just meats, but they're seasoned, they're portioned out, just everything you could ask for. Like they have brisket, roasted garlic herb chicken, Jamaican beef, like all these different kinds of meats. And I'm just like, I will never go shop for meats again. Stop playing with me. And Mia Snow was just talking about how freaking good they were. And I was like, I want some. And literally, I almost bought some last night, but then I had to remember who the freak that I was. I said, Mackenzie, you're an influencer. Reach out to these people. So I was like, we're not going to buy it yet. We're going to reach out to them to see if we can get some free meats with the discount code to promote to my people, to my bokies. Um, so I reached out to them on TikTok, and they were like, yes, of course, reach out to so-and-so. So I reached out to her just now. So fingers crossed. She's like, yes, girl, choose four that you want to try. Here's going to be your discount code because I showed her my stats for YouTube and TikTok, my analytics, which I think is really good. So <laughs> I'm excited and I'm hopeful, but it's really just cool to know that I'm in a space where I can do that. It's really cool. It's really cool. But anyway, I will see you guys once I get the crazy puffs and we'll try it together. All right. Bye. All right, y'all. So I got the crazy puffs in my wings and I'm back to work. Oh, I'm about to enter into the gates and about to get parked. We're going to stay in the car and eat today because, I don't know, I just don't want to be bothered and talk to people. And I know they're going to be like, ooh, oh, what is that? I don't want to talk. I don't want to talk. I want to sit in my car and watch an episode of SWAT and then go back in and be ready to start my day. Y'all, I'm watching the Dear Future Wifey podcast with the episode. I think it's called Sexual Healing with Rita and Theo. Oh, my God. I am obsessed. It was cold. Hello. Thank you. You too. It is freezing out here. Oklahoma, get it together now. Um, let's go see if we can get us a good parking spot. Let's go see if we can get us a good parking spot. I'm kind of sad because I really want to die at Dr. Pepper. Um, but like, I don't want to go in there just to get one and come back out because at my job, like we have the fountains and the fountains are free. And like, that is so cool and all, but like, I don't want to go in there and then just to come back out and somebody got my spot. Let's see if we can find us a good one. And that person behind me, they took the one that I should have got, but it was too far. Yes, thank you, Jesus, right here. When I made you, oh, this is a hand. Oh, I'm so excited, y'all. My mouth is watering. I feel like there's no way these can't be good. All right. We're in here. All right. We're going to sit this seat back. So we got the hot wings. Y'all already know what these look like. Just normal hot wings. I feel like eating pizza without hot wings is like eating chicken nuggets without fries. Like, who does that? I don't want to do that. So this is what the little box looks like. Mm -hmm. Come on. Open up for big flavors. Oh, my God. Oh, I know I'm about to go. Oh, my God. Look at these babies. Look at. Okay. Are y'all ready? We're going to take the first bite together. Then I'm about to turn on my show. Cheers. Oh, 
Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. This security is really riding around. Boy, go do something with your life. Go do something with your life. These are amazing. Oh my God. Lord, give me the self control. Mackenzie, you can't just keep eating these every single day of the week now. Y'all, these are good. 10 out of 10. All right, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye. Bookies. So I'm off of work and I was going to wait to go to Whole Foods tomorrow, but it's supposed to be below freezing tomorrow. And I know I'm not going to want to do a god dang thing. So we're about to go to Whole Foods now to get all the things to be making the best salads for the week. And I'm going to take you guys along with me. And I already told myself to not go in here spending all the money because we all know, if you don't know, Whole Foods is expensive. Whole Foods is a pretty penny. And every single time I go to these places, I'm like, oh, this is cool. Oh, this is nice. No, we can't do that. We're in there for lettuce and cheese. That is it. I'll see you guys there. <laughs> okay you guys so so far i have two of these things of lettuce and the spring mix to mix it in for extra veggies but this is the cheese she was talking about i thought i was gonna have to get help parmigiano reggiano it's just a whole stack of cheese so we're gonna get this and then make a salad all right first things first y'all should be so proud of me i literally went into whole foods with one mission and one mission only which was to get some good lettuce some good greens and to get my parmigiano reggiano thanks to at me snow for putting your grill on first of all i wanted to look through every aisle and ooh ah let's try this we can't do that in this season we cannot do that unless we are real life sacrificing like everything else that we're doing i don't have time to do it I also needed a cheese grater, and they are cheese graters. Their cheapest one was $11.98. Absolutely the freak not. Um, but anyway, I'm just like, Kenzie, who are you going to Whole Foods? I feel like a fancy beach. <laughs> so, okay, this is the Parmigiano Reggiano. Um, yeah, I've never, who am I becoming, bro? I've never gotten like, real fresh cheese before so i'm really excited to use this and i'm gonna go to walmart to get me a three dollar cheese grater that's gonna work the same as a 12 dollar one period um and then i'm sure as you guys know first of all y'all know if you've seen my other vlogs that i'm super used to getting those bacon caesar salad kits and first of all crazy expensive three something dollars for just one salad and like i said it was all because i never went the right places to get the good greens y'all these greens look so beautiful so y'all know i don't like vegetables for real so i got a small thing of spring mix just to add more veggies but to mix it in with normal lettuce and some of it um but the beautiful greens in the start of the show is whatever this is true harvest it's just like two full things of romaine lettuce and I got two of these because I love me some salads. And at first I was just going to get one because I was like, Kenzie, if you don't eat it, then it's just going to be wasted. But no, Whole Foods is not close to my house. So I was like, what if you eat it all and then you're mad you didn't get another one? No, we're getting two and I'm going to make sure I eat them. We're not wasting food. Um. So yeah, we got all those things and I'm super excited. I'm not going to make a salad tonight, clearly, because I don't have a cheese grater um i could go to walmart today but i highly doubt it because it is 5 30 which means i'm in the middle of five o'clock traffic right now and it's just not that necessary we will literally go tomorrow and we will get it on lunch but i'm just super excited because first of all i don't think i've ever been to a whole foods in my life y'all like when i tell you i really feel like when i move into this house my whole everything is about to change because i have a backyard now they got plants over here i was like i want to get a plant and like let's play around with come on Y'all better subscribe to me in this new journey that I'm about to be on. We're about to just get in our bag of becoming. That's the only thing I can think of right now is that we are becoming, becoming the her, becoming the me that I have always envisioned myself to be. I made a post earlier that was like, it may have taken me years to change my habits. It may have taken me years to make these small progressions. But at the end of the day, I'm proud of the progress, right? Um, 
So yeah, slowly but surely, we're getting to that version of myself that I've always known myself to be. And I'm super excited to meet her. And I'm excited that you guys are on this journey with me. All right, we're going back home now. Um, I love you guys. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Oh, I so forgot to tell you guys. And so you guys know those viral cups that are going around right now, the Stanley cups and stuff like that. Like, I'm the type of girl, first of all, we, we done did good on our water. There's nothing in here. I'm the type of girl to carry around a gallon, okay? I can't carry around those little bottles. And my problem is that I will buy bottles just because that, just because they're cute, but I don't use them because I literally carry around a gallon all day. This place almost got me because they didn't have the Stanley Cups, but these are the cups going viral on TikTok, the Simply Modern. Y'all, they were so cute, and I almost did it. Why are those cups $35? And why did I almost buy it? And then I heard the Lord say, play with me if you want to, because you know I told you we're not doing that. <laughs> why would you say I can't get candy and you took me to the candy store? <laughs> I just can't wait till I'm rich, man, because what? Whole Foods is a vibe. Man. Anyway, I'm going to go home now and act like I got some sense about myself. <laughs> All right, Bookie Boo Melon, so I'm home, and I after I went to Whole Foods, I ended up going to Walmart because I don't remember if I told you guys, but we're supposed to be having a winter storm rolling in, and I was like, as much as I do not want to go to Walmart, I need to go to Walmart to finish up what I need for my groceries, or else I am not going to have a good week, because winter storm, I'm not going anywhere. Um, so anywho, so I already showed you guys that dirty dishes. I already showed you guys the Parmigiano Reggiano, the spring mix, and then again, I got two bad boys of these. When I tell you, this is the most beautiful lettuce I've ever seen in my life. I am so excited about the salads I'm about to be making. So I have all of that, and then one that, what I ended up getting from Walmart, honestly, it wasn't random stuff. It was stuff I needed, but it was random because, anyway, I got some butter because I need butter. I ended up getting me a $3 cheese grater. It may not be cute like the $12 ones, but baby, I bet you we can grate some cheese, period. I got me some oranges to snack on. I got me some bacon bits because I love putting bacon bits in my Caesar salads. Um, I love me the Kinder seasoning, and I always hear people talk about these two. So this is the, Jesus, this is the steak blend and the wood fire garlic. I'm gonna try that on the chicken tenderloins that I got for my salad. We're gonna try this tomorrow and we'll be able to see how they taste. Y'all know I'm a press on nail girly and my collection has run dry. I am out. So, and it's funny because y'all, I don't even like pink, but for some reason I love pink on my nails. Y'all, I got dang near every shade of pink that they had and I'm so excited. And yeah, we are gonna make sure them nails is dead. I got me my favorite must-have drink, my Red Diamond Sweet Tea. And then I got me some Red Hot because, baby, what? You need Red Hot, and I was out. These are the chicken tenderloins. I'm going to cook them, and I'm really hoping that I can find a way to cook chicken to where I enjoy it in my salad. Um, usually I get chicken breasts, and all y'all know that chicken breasts be drying out. Um, so Chelsea was like, no, try chicken tenderloins. So I'm hoping that these will be much easier and I will love it. I, I just hope that I will love it. Because I don't know why, but it's like for some reason I'm always like, if I go out to eat places, I'm like, they have the best chicken Caesar salads ever. I'm like, how do y'all make this chicken? How? Anyway, and then I got me some eggs because a lot of the things I'm trying to work on, like I told y'all, I'm trying to save money in this season and be cost effective. So I want to rule out those salad kits. Spend way too much money when you can just go and buy things of lettuce and make your stuff your own. And then two, y'all know I've been obsessed with those Jimmy Dean egg bowls. Baby, them things is $3 a bowl. So three times five, that's $15. And baby, you could literally just buy your thing of eggs. You got you some bacon bits. You got some sausage. Like, why are we wasting money? So as much as it is convenient, we're in a season where, baby, we don't have convenient type of money. Make your food at home. Um, so yeah, that concludes today's vlog. I don't know if I'm going to be dropping daily vlogs or what, so just bear with me because we just going to make it do what it do. And if I feel like dropping a daily vlog, then I'm going to be dropping a daily vlog. And today, I just decided to drop a daily vlog. Anyway, I will see you guys later. Let me know if you guys like this kind of video. Like we did a whole grocery haul and we really 
spent like sun up to sundown with me. <sighs> anyway, so yeah, I'm about to put up these groceries. I'm about to take a shower. I'm about to eat. I'm about to do Bible study with Chelsea. I'm about to make my agenda for the week. There's just so much to do. And I got to get up in the morning at 3. I got to go. Talk to you later. Bye. Oh,